Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Elder Scrolls 2 Daggerfall. In the last episode, we finished six quests, was it? Yeah, we finished six quests for the Temple of Akatosh, and in this episode we should theoretically be finished with the Temple of Akatosh. There's only five quests left for them. And then if we don't reach max rank, I'll do what I did for all the other ones and I'll just kind of include a clip of me reaching max rank for them. But uh yeah, we should be finished with them in this episode, and then at the end of today's episode, because we finished with Fool's Ebony, finally, uh, we're going to go back to our one book a day at the end of each episode. So, uh, yeah, and then, then I don't know if we're going to be doing Thieves' Guild this episode, or at the end, or at the start of next episode, but Thieves' Guild should be next. And so, let's talk to Aggie. Your loyalty and skill have not gone unnoticed, Vassif. In fact, it is my honor to inform you that the Temple Elders have decided to give you a new title, that of Disciple but it's more than a title. With it, you have a new privilege in the temple, the right to use our potion maker. Talk to our mixer if you don't believe me. Congratulations. Great. Now, let me quickly pull up and look at what that specific rank does. It was what disciple was it? So that's rank five. Okay. And then, so we got four more ranks to go technically okay and then that should theoretically get me all of the quests now yep the great evil finally appeared so we need to do today's episodes we're going to be doing a delivery the relic the rite of atonement the great evil and finally we're going to end with avenge the dragons and that is all the quests that i have listed uh from the uasp for the temple but just like it was for the fighters guild when we reach you know max rank you know a, a quest might pop up via one of the mods we have so we have to be careful so there theoretically could be another quest but it could come from a mod but we'll see but let's start with a delivery blessings upon you Vasif. the order of the hour needs you to run an errand for us this common symbol needs to be delivered to white witch within 41 days you will receive a temple fee of 500 gold pieces can you do it for us absolutely here take the common symbol talk to elizine kington at the garrison residence in white witch Oh, I almost forgot to mention that a rival temple may send out thugs to stop you. Well, bring it. Uh, let's go to our log. And for some reason, we can't uh, do our normal uh, thing that we learned about in go via our uh, active quest menu. But we can do it the old-fashioned way, so why not? Bring out our sword in case we get attacked. And now, happy oh dear God in heaven, it's going to be a nightmare. Please be kind, people of White Bitch. What time is it? It's seven in the morning. Okay, there should be theoretically people. Let me put my sword away because I don't actually. Let's bring my sword out. Let's intimidate people. Screw it. They've been mean to me anyway. There we go. Excuse me, sir. Can you tell me the location? Care him residence. Is that what we wanted? Yeah, the Garham residence is what we wanted. Okay, have, you have to be careful and sometimes sure. It's west of where I'm standing. Okay, so west. Okay, so we've theoretically cut off or already about half of the city. So at least we've narrowed it down already. Is it this place? No. Hopefully this person will be able to point us directly to it. Uh, don't care? Well, you should care, sir. I could kill you just like that. And, you know, I have no qualms about it whatsoever. I am a member of the Dark Brotherhood. Well, you don't know that, but I know it. Oh boy. There we go. Excuse me. Hi. Can you please tell me where the Garham residence is? Thank you for marking on my map. As I immediately walk right past it, it's this building right here. Yep. Great, great, great. Uh, you deliver it probably to you? Nope. Not you. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh,. Have to check the attic. Last couple people have been inside the attic, so it's gonna be you. Kinnor's favor upon you, Vasp. The common symbol is sorely needed. Here, I understand that you are given a temple fee of 500 gold pieces. Great, I take it. Th that should the. Someone says, come on. Oh, I went to the. I was wanting to get on my horse. Okay, we'll get back on our horse and go back to Pinbury Hamlet. And we can go in, and I think probably because we already got 500 gold, I'm pretty sure that quest is already technically finished, but we can always be sh uh, doubly sure and go and ask, but I feel like we're going to be finished with it 
already. So we're gonna the next quest we're picking up is the relic. So if all of these quests are as short as this is, which is just like delivery quests, which I doubt it is, because this one was literally called a delivery. Uh, we might be doing the thieves guild this episode, but uh, if they're longer, then we'll probably do shorter. In fact, we might do shorter anyways. Cause the last two episodes kind of long. Hmm. Let me see what takes we. Uh, let me see what tasks we have available. Let's do the relic. Uh, Disciple or order of the hour needs you for a dangerous mission to retrieve one of our lost talismans of Akatosh. You will have to defy the power of Vios, the, its creator, who then betrayed the temple and flank it into the evil. He is now a lich and still guards the talisman. Are you willing, not listen, dude? I have fought a lot of liches at this point. I admire your courage, but tremble to think the dangers you are about to face. Vios guards the talisman of Akatosh and ruins a Masterson's palace. Remember, there is no need to slay the lich. Just retrieve the talisman and return it to the order of the hour here. We have no word from you for if we have no word from you in 20 days we will chant the song of the departed for you akatosh blessings upon you Asa. dude you're not even gonna have to do that dude i got this i'm not scared whatsoever of any liches vampires yes because vampires seem to kill me quite uh quite easily but liches they can they can you know hurt me but i can hurt them as well and go in here oh Okay, I was supposed to say, we don't even have a door. We do, okay. Rest. Uh, save over this rune start, because I'm pretty sure this is another runes. And get our be smart me. Grab a locator device. You bought like 75 of them. And we can begin. And we're going to do our... We've been forgetting our, our... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we've been forgetting our standard of just hugging the left wall strats that we kind of abandoned. We need to heal. Not because, you know, we're desperate to hurt, but just because he theoretically could do a lot of damage to us. But we kind of forgot our hugging the left wall, really, the left wall strats. So I'm wanting to go back to it just because it's good practice to, to remember. I need to kind of heal again, if you don't mind. You're kind of screwing me up quite bad. No, no. Okay, seriously, if this entire place is going to be lich, I'm going to be so angry, even though it seems like this is just going to be just a gigantic, uh, just a gigantic location full of liches. Okay. I think I see it. I just got to figure out how to get to it. Which means we've got to find a lever somewhere. But I already feel good. I feel like that was what we were looking for. Okay, I will be back, because I'm going to be honest. I, it's going to be a while, and I actually do probably want to do maybe at least join the Thieves Guild in this episode, or at least try and attempt to make our attempts at joining the Thieves Guild. So I'm actually going to um, get cut here, and I'll be back once we find what we're looking for. All right, we finally got in here. And let's take all of this stuff. Grab our talisman. This surely the order is great. Recall. Get out of here. See you later. Adios. And I almost went back to Gothway Guard. That's not where we're wanting to go. I actually need to know where this is on the map. Where is this on the map so I can just kind of click it now? Okay, it's this little tiny dot. I I should theoretically remember it, but knowing me, it'll take me a you know hot minute. But I will be back once we are uh, turning in this quest. Okay, we're back. Here you go, dude. What? You not only retrieved the sacred talisman, but also killed the evil Veos? You truly are one of Akatosh's favorite ones. You will surely rise far in order. Praise to the great Akatosh. I had not allowed myself to hope that you would actually succeed. Akatosh's favor will surely shine upon you for this deed. As a small token of the temple's gratitude, please accept this enchanted loincloth. Really? I'm not wearing an enchanted loincloth, dude. Uh, let's mark, uh, I forgot to actually mark the last quest also as complete, so let's mark both of these past two quests that we've done as complete. There, and I can actually write the correct name. There, done, done, great. Moving on to Rite of in Atonement. They tell me that you're quite loyal to the temple. I need you to perform a vital task for us. Akatosh has become angry with us. Really? Again? You need to concern yourself with why. You oh, sorry, you need not concern yourself with why. Our only hope is to hold a Rite of Atonement. We need ectoplasm from the ceremony. My sources tells me that some can be found in the Citadel of Hawking. Will you bring it to us? Yeah, the ceremony will be in 15 days. High five or four gold. Unattainted. Yeah, we did this literally last episode with the basilisk sigh. 
you're not going to take any ectoplasm I have in my uh, inventory, so I'm going to have to go literally to this place and go to Foggy McFoggy Town and find some. Hail, friend. Uh, oh, thank God. Hello. You stay way back here while I swing and say hello that way. And go right in here. And recall anchor rest can't rest uh citadel start overwrite the last citadel start try and lock pick it doesn't unlock of course because we can never be that lucky can we lock never get that lucky Ooh, a lever you love to see it I, I, I'm not loving the fact that there's already four, five ways to go. I also don't like the fact that I got tried to get snuck up on. Okay. No, no, no. You need to just die. Thank you. Oh! <gasps> Ladies and gentlemen, it has happened. Even though it says 7 to 24, I thought the Daedric Daikatana was better than the Daedric Claymore. Interesting. I... I'm going to do a quick moment to research because I could have swore the Daedric Daikatana did more damage than the Daedric Claymore. Give me two seconds. Okay, interesting. I'm seeing different things because this is saying that this is correct, but the, the bunch of different sites say this is correct. So I don't know. I've oh, but I said I've wanted a Daikatana, so screw it. Going with the Daikatana. And if that screws me over, that's if I'm losing technically, what is it? One damage is what I'm losing. Eight to 25. If I'm losing one damage in both directions, so a maximum of two damage per swing, it's fine. But I set up in wanting a Daikatana, and a Daikatana is what I'm getting. And I think it swings a little bit faster, actually, so I'll actually like that. Uh, can we rest a little bit? Thank you. And now let me save while I have the ability to save. Uh, if you guys are watching this, and you know the answer in Daggerfall Unity, which one's better... Because on the US UESP wiki, it says that the, the, the Daikaton is better, but it also says in Daggerfall Unity, the displayed things are correct, so... I don't know. I could... I who knows? You know. Oh well. We're going with it, though. Oh, hello, Daedra. Goodbye, Daedra. But now, we're almost... Guys, I said, by the end of the, the, the series, we're going to be decked out in Daedra. We just got to get the Daedric boots. Oh, hello, other fire Daedra. No, 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 just cut it out. So now we just gotta get lucky and hope for one more, and if not, we're probably gonna go around to shops and see, because I, I, the game, the game is not going to be done, period, end of story, I'm saying it now, the game will not be finished until we are decked out in uh, Daedric. Interesting. If I undo that, do you open? You do not. Then let me reactivate you. I said let me reactivate you. Thank you. Hmm. Okay. And if I activate you... Do you open? No, but if I unactivate both of you, do you open? Oh, hello, you kind of frightened me a little bit. Okay, well, let me now, I guess... You teleported, good sir. You can't do that. Who told you you could do that? Yeah, I'm going to heal because I'm just a tiniest bit hurt. And if you don't mind coming down here and facing me like a, like a like an actual legitimate person instead of a you know a cheating cheating cheaterson, I will be happy to face you in honorable combat. And I will activate this lever. And now let me rest just the tiniest amount because I'm a little bit exhausted as far as stamina goes. And now the game actually legitimately begins. Um, there was a secret door here. Yep. Okay, which one do you activate? You don't activate there, but do you activate this one all the way down here? You do! Great! Oh my god! Okay, a miracle has happened. We've actually made progress. A little bit, a uh, little bit uh, puzzly, but you know, we like puzzles. It's better than the, just the generic go through the, the dungeon and try and just kill everything quickly. Excuse me. That is, I believe, Death 15. That was my own hubris. Getting the better of me. I did not see that I was as hurt as I was. Where am I at? I 
have no idea. Okay, here's the thing. If I die, I'll include it. If I level up, I'll include it, but I'm... Hello, Daedra. I'm stuck on... Oh, I'm stuck on the door. There we go. Um, but I will be back... Excuse me. Thank you. I will be back... Uh, excuse me. I need to heal. Thank you. I will be back. If I die, I'll include it, which is... There's a... So if I die like like this exactly right here, if I die like this moment, like, like I just did, I'll definitely include it. If I level up, I'll include it. But uh, yeah, I'm not going to subject you guys to watching me rage here. Uh, so I'll be back. Uh, Death 17 is here. Uh, this is uh, not being a this is I'm this is not a good uh, this is not fun. So I keep dying to this 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 Daedra Lord over here. Uh, well, first off, I gotta deal with you because you're gonna be a scumbag. And can I please get in the damn door? Thank you. Now you. Excuse me. I want to fireball. Excuse me. I want to fireball you. I don't even know if I can fireball you. I don't know if you're. Oh, you are set. Fireball. Love to see it. Okay. Now, Phil. Excuse me. I need to rest. Thank you. Uh, let's not fire. Excuse me. Thank you. Oh my gosh. This is. No, 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 no. Stop it. Okay. You cut it out. I actually need to go and drop some stuff off because I am a little bit over encumbered by a lot. What is weighing me down? Probably all of this stuff is what's weighing me down. And the 12,000 gold. Yeah, so we'll drop off actually every bit of gold as well. Not all that gold because I don't have that much, but okay. Uh, go this way, this way, this way, correct? No, but we're here now and we're doing it. Here. Uh, Q. There we go. If you want to shoot magic at me, I'm going to shoot magic at you. We've not been doing a whole lot of magic in this playthrough. But, uh, damn it, if that's what it takes to me not to die. Hello? Oh no! Oh no 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 I need to rest. Really? Who? Oh, thank God. Well, I, I was asking for a challenge, and uh, the game listened. At least it's not liches, it's Nature Lord, it's okay. I'm gonna be sneaky now. And I will be back with any, uh, anything of note. I found it, finally, oh my god. This, that I can feel the priority of blah, 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 who cares, get out of here, get out of here, run, just get out of here. I can recall, I just remembered, but at this point, let's assert dominance and just get out of here because I remember how to get out of here because I actually got it here luckily it's right here here and there oh thank god uh drop off all this stuff though quickly before we actually just straight up leave okay so that was what three deaths to this dungeon four deaths to this dungeon and more deaths than I would have liked but uh no it's nice to to be humbled and remember that even though you're level 24 Samuel that uh you're go you this game can where am I oh I know where I am now uh, that this game can still uh, mess you up quite uh, quite a bit if it decides to. Now, it's typically just from those, you know, being exhausted things. I think probably most about 99% of my deaths have been from me being exhausted and leaving me to be ravaged by monsters, but uh, instead of actually being damaged to death, but oh well. So that was the Rite of Atonement. The next one is the Great Evil, and then we have Avenge the Dragon, which is a quest that is specific to the temple of Akatosh, and each temple has a specific quest to them, but since we're only doing the temple of Akatosh, we're only going to be doing the, the Akatosh specific quest. Uh, hey dude, you have an ectoplasm. Akatosh will be pacified. You've done well. Here's your reward. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then let's do the great evil. Fast, my name, we know who you are. Akatosh has prophesied a great evil growing in the heart of a nearby dungeon. We need you to go destroy this thing. Will you do it? Absolutely. There's no time to waste. Travel to the cavern of... I believe we were there last episode. There you'll find 
the talisman. Destroy it within ten days and all will be well again. A sign will appear in the temple when it is done. Return to me and I'll pay you well. Done. Alright. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Need to keep remembering to do that. It's been so many episodes of me just going to my... Going backspace. Because I believe backspace for me is the, the world map. Got so used to doing that, now I completely forgot I can just do it from my quest menu. Here, perfect. Recall, anchor, rest, save, cavern, start. I believe I have a locator device on me because I did not need it for the last quest, which is great. And I know we said going left, but I just want to check this way because it was technically shorter. And now we can begin our old, old faithful... I can never even unlock it at level 2, man. This is so depressing. Oh, hello! Really? Listen, you're not a danger lord ghost. You don't scare me that much. I'm about to take the 144 gold, though. That doesn't scare me at all whatsoever. I'm just appreciative of it. And then... Okay, make sure there is no secret compartments that way. not see secret compartments that way. Are you crazy? Uh, oh, but there's a barbarian this way, so if you'll excuse me, I'm going to swing about 20 times, and then you're going to end up dead. Any day now, there we go. I still don't know which one does more, the claim more of the, uh, the Daikatana, but, you know, at this point, we're stuck with the, the Daikatana until the end of the game. Even if I'm wrong at this point, I have to do it just to say that I was right. Excuse me, thank you, barbarian, even though you were clothed. Um... That was a dead end. Correct, that was a dead end. Great, okay. Oh no, it's a, our favorite enemy, the Lich. Excuse me, fireball. And I'm gonna fireball and a fireball, thank you. I'm gonna start- I'm gonna try and start using Magicka more. I haven't really done it a whole lot this playthrough. I stick a lot more to, uh, to- to combat, I think, this- this go-around. I think in Arena I was a little bit more- did a little bit more magic. Uh, I don't want to technically go that way quite yet. I prefer to stay down here, just a little bit. I will be happy to come up there and fight you, though, thank you. And this actually doesn't look like it's going to be too long of a way, but I am immediately proven wrong. Because I, of course, have to be. Okay, excuse me. No, thank you. Uh, I'll take both of you, though. And I will rest, because I want my magic back. Thank you. And I have a good feeling about this direction, though. Okay, no, 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 thank you. Okay, I've learned something. Liches, let's use magic on them. Why not? My fireball spell seems to be doing pretty well against them. Nothing in here. Great. Are you a barbarian? I have a feeling you're a barbarian because you're definitely not going down, so you're absolutely a barbarian. Okay, there you go. Barbarian. Oh, Daedric Bow, even though I don't need it. I do need Daedric uh, boots, though. So if you want to drop Daedric stuff, that is, uh, if you want to make me a very, very happy person, that would be what you need to drop. Uh, that does not unlock, which is unfortunate, but I will come in here and I will kill you, Barbarian, for killing that Dragonling. Goodbye. Nothing of note. Uh, don't want the small statue at the moment. Maybe when we officially buy a house, we'll take it, but at the moment, no. Is there- is this explored enough to where we can use the little- no, not quite, okay. Head check. That is not the button I wanted. This is the button I wanted. Go back this way, here, and that's straight up a dead end, so I don't know why I thought I was being clever or cute or just smart, and that's also a dead end. And this direction is a... not the way. It's this way, correct, correct, and then this way is where we've not been, so let's go this way. Uh, okay. okay, let's immediately turn around, because there's multiple liches that way, and I- Hell- Oh, we've not really f it's been a long time since we faced one of you. Hello, Scorpion. Um, dead end, of course. Door over here is gonna probably be dead end, if my memory serves me correctly of how these dungeons are typically laid out, and it is a dead end. You know, 30, what is this now? Episode 32, so 32 episodes of, uh, ooh. Take all that stuff. 32 episodes, and I have a pretty good feeling for most of these dungeon layouts now. Oh, hello. Um, excuse me. Goodbye. 
I, for some reason, wanted to hit you with the extra... There are enemies nearby, which is kind of unfortunate, gonna be honest. Uh, can I, uh, free action, thank you. Can I, can I come, also come in here and just take a tiny little bit of a nap? I... Who? No, no, no. Fireball there. We fireballed each other. Okay, it's fine. Now I want to rest. And I actually need to save. Before I, you know, have problems. Cavern, exploring. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And go back over here. Nope, not here. There we go. Oh, hello. No, goodbye to you. Uh, excuse me. Oh, that's why I need to not recall. I need a free action. Thank you. Take all of that stuff and rest a tiny, a tiny bit. And if we're at this layout, no, I see. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Take all of that. What are we even looking for? We're looking for, what is it? Oh, we're looking for some kind of great. Well, that's right. Okay. Is there a great evil behind this door? What about this door? No. Okay. Any great evils lurking around here? Nope, just a lot of liches. Okay, I could actually use a tiny bit of a nap because I'm a little bit out of Magicka. I'm feeling like I'm possibly going the wrong way. Also, can I use my locator device now? Apparently not. Unfortunate. Let's go back this way because simply because we didn't explore all this way and I found a lot of the time the area where we need to be is in this type of typical kind of location when it looks like this. So let's just kind of explore this to be sure because there's typically a hidden room somewhere in here. Okay, that's all explored, correct? No. Down this way and down this way has not been explored. Okay. And in neither of this direction has been explored. Oh, there's a door. No. Okay. Great. Great, great. Need to remember to use the... Okay. 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 Perfectly. Perfectly good. Understandable. Uh, in this layout, it's typically over this way. Okay. Excuse me, barbarian. Okay. No, okay, barbarians. I take it back. Okay. Well, you don't really frighten me too terribly much. I just do need to be a little bit worry, um, worrisome of my, my health, but... Unless you decide to royally screw me over, we should be okay. As long as there's not, like, 65 Daedra Lords that are coming in. Uh, bring it on, one and all. I am more than happy to face each of you. If you don't mind, uh, I, I actually would like a little moment to heal. I know it's uh, kind of uh, cheesy on my part to use a heal, but, uh, you know, I decided to, you know, learn healing, and you decided to be a barbarian, so... We all made choices in our lives, and we have to stick with it. I'll take you... Daedric Brigantine have plus 14. Okay, so it's not as good, but that's interesting. I've not really seen Daedric Brigantine, so that's interesting. Uh, kind of, a, I guess, amalgamation of uh, both. Uh, is there a door here? There is typically a door here. Is there... Okay, excuse me. I don't like that, and I'm going to hit you accordingly with such. Okay, excuse me, thank you. And now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna rest because I'm a little bit hurt and I'm out of magic. And apparently you don't wish to to be of you know importance and assistance. So hello spiders. If you wanna come and get it. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye to you. And if so it wasn't in this location. So if it's not in this location. Then it's typically over here. It's never going to be here, but I do want to check what's in here. I don't want those pants. I'm going to be 100% honest. And then it's typically... Okay. I need to be careful, but I can just take it out like this, because I don't quite have enough magic to fireball it down. And it typically now be this way, this way, this way, up here... Have I been here? I've been here before. Okay, so it's not this way then. Hmm, interesting. Oh, there we go. Level 25. My goodness, it took forever, it felt like. This is like the first level we've had in like four, like five or six, seven episodes. Okay. 
this is probably going to get close to the, maybe the second to last or third to last level up we get. I don't think we're probably going to get too many more in the game. And we're getting, like I said, everything's going to personality now because everything that we want to level to 100 is already 100. So I uh, can go on ahead and save this at Exploring 2 now, though, that we progress and we'll see how many more level ups we get. I don't imagine it's going to be too, too, too many more. Uh, go down this way because this will be, at least bring us down here to the... Oh, did you not die? Okay, get down here and face me, because I I will come up there and face you, but I'd rather not have to use my, you know, levitate spell. Okay, anything down here? Just dread deck dragonlings. Okay. Uh. Anything else of note? No. But I can probably use my locator device now. Correct. Correct. Where? This direction. Okay. Now the question is how to get there. It's going to be this way, this way, this way, this way. Okay, no, 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 no. Cut it out. Okay, perfect. I really went in all, all in with those fireballs. Because if, man, if those fireballs did not hit, I was kind of screwed. Uh, but I can rest. I apparently can't rest. There is no rest for the wicked. Really? Who? Who is disturbing my sleep? Can I rest here? Thank you. Really? Dude, I'm trying to take a nap. Will you please leave me alone? Thank you. Uh... So we... We've... Kinda, okay, it's this way. Definitely feel good about this, somewhat. I, I'm gonna be honest, if we go up anymore, I'm gonna feel a little less good. I'm feeling a little less good about this now. Simply because now we're not even on the same plane. The same level. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit better. I'm feeling a little bit worse. Can we go? I'm feeling a whole lot better. It's gonna be this lever. Oh, yeah. This is the good stuff, I think. Maybe. Or maybe not. Okay. Uh, if you, excuse me, I'm going to go back up just for a brief second. Because typically, there's a second a lever over here. And maybe this is what I'm looking for. Excuse me. Okay, here. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, found it. Uh, excuse me, I need to go kill a barbarian. Okay. Can you just please, I'm trying to kill, or not kill, I'm trying to, to get rid of a great evil and you're being really kind of a nuisance, thank you very much. But we'll take, you don't want the gloves, dude. No, we definitely don't want to wear the gloves. Are you insane? Uh, okay, and we can try and unlock, okay, now we're gonna just cast open. Get rid of you. Uh rest because once we apparently activate it some great evil is going to come about so i'd rather be fully decked out and ready as you reach for the talisman it transforms into a beautiful woman what a tasty young mortal i can see you came to destroy the talisman i have a better idea if i give you this magic gauntlets you go back to the temple and tell them that you couldn't find the talisman they can hardly blame you and get to keep the gauntlets uh no then die like the pious mortal you are okay uh the curse is lifted and you should report to agrin morsley okay great that was not too difficult. No, no, no. Let's look and see what they got. We'll take all of that stuff, though. And now we can recall and teleport and drop off all of this junk that I don't ever use it for. Maybe eventually, if I ever play a game, this game again, I'll actually learn to use the, uh, the crafting or the potion making system. But this playthrough, probably not at this point. If I haven't done it now, I'm not going to. Go back to Pinbury. Pinbury Hamlet, of course, is the Pinbury I'm talking about. And I, of course, spawn in on the south side, so I'll be back once we are at the... Oh, holy hell. What in the God's green earth is this? Excuse me. This is ridiculous. In fact, I, this is so ridiculous. Can I get all of you together for a screenshot, please? Thank you. Okay, no, 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 no. Free action. 
Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you. What in the world was all of this? Listen, I've said it before and I'll say it again. If you're going to take a shot at the champ, you best not miss. Now listen, those Daedric Lords, they did miss. In fact, let me take a moment to go and do something smart like cure. Like cure. I'm apparently silenced. That, okay. Because I can cure things at the temple. So hopefully I'm not immediately just dead with, you know, no, uh, no recourse. Hopefully I can get back to the temple in time. Because I'm feeling like one of those did something to me. I just got a nasty little feeling in the pit of my stomach. So go back here. Go quickly over here. Uh, I'm healed. You're no neonate anymore, fast. If the council has elected you to promote you to the title of diviner, a very honored position in the temple, and as such, you are given a terrible privilege, the right to summon Daedra. Obviously, the theological implications alone should give you pause, but if, in your wisdom, you decide to summon a prince of oblivion, we will aid you in your endeavor. Summoner will obviously be able to tell you more. Whatever you decide to do will be uh, will be wise. After all, you are diviner now. Great, that's actually not who I was wanting to talk to, though. I need I need healing, possibly. I'm possibly a little sick. Cure disease. Yeah, no disease. Okay, who does curing of poison, though? Somebody here, because I made a... Uh, I, bought, I bought a... I, I downloaded a uh, Temple's Cure Poison now. So one of you theoretically should be able to cure poison. And I'm currently silenced, and that's a little bit worrisome. I believe I already talked to you. I did, okay? Uh, and then what do you do? Now, you do, you do Daedra summoning specifically. Okay, that's fine. But I'm looking specifically so someone could, like, maybe cure me a poison. Because I have a feeling I might be poisoned. Cure poison? I'm still silenced. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, well, if I die of poison, I die of poison. Even though somebody here should be willing to... Like, no, wait, wait, I could buy potions. Are you insane? And where's my exit? Here's the exit. Okay. Buy potions. No, not make potions. Buy potions. Do you have a cure poison? Anything? Invisibility? Cure poison. Right, I will buy that. 101 gold, I will happily pay that stupid amount. Great. Now I don't even have to worry. I'm healed. Great. Love to see it. I apparently somehow teleported down here. Go up here. I always get lost. Here we are. Turn you in. Bass, you have the thanks of all our clergy. The evil has been destroyed. As I promised, here's 428 gold pieces for your reward. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Mark, both of the last quests is complete because I did not uh, complete the uh, last one. And finally... Did I? Okay, I'm having kind of a stupid moment. Did I? It was the last quest I did, the Great Evil. I believe it was. Uh, so we're going to do Avenge the Dragons. If you are, by chance, looking for a work, an easy 619 gold pieces, I just might have the job be. It'll involve some combat. But you look like you wouldn't mind that. It does, but does it sound like a positive? Absolutely, I'll take it. Very good. You know that the Akatosh is the god of time, but he is also a dragon god. We hold dragons as our holy symbol. One of our members of our fighting order, the Order of the Hour, has apparently gone berserk and taken to attacking our dragons right in our sacred grove. Of course, the murderer must be stopped. We will find the dragon slayer in a place called Tower Hearth Heart. If you are not successful within 13 days, we will send the Order of the Hour in, and after your reward, we will be forfeited. May Akatosh bless you on your quest. Okay, well, let's go get rid of this uh, this crazy berserker. And this is the last quest of the, the temples for us to do. So I... Uh, how long have we been recording? Uh, this is now, I'm recording back-to-back, -back, so this is the same technically recording session. So, But we've been recording, I believe... Uh, we have been recording, I believe, for roughly about 40 minutes or so. I don't know. I have no idea. Some warrior- oh boy. Hello. I'm not gonna make you guys sit here and watch this, so I'll be back after I kill these 46 waves of people. Okay, apparently it wasn't 46 waves. Normally it's like 6 waves like it is with the orcs, but it was only just those, so it wasn't that bad. Okay. Go in here. Go with you. Anyway, uh, we've been running long the last few episodes, so, uh, hi. Excuse me. Uh, fireball, fireball, fireball. Thank you. No, thank you. I'm not interested. 
Okay, well, maybe I am interested because you guys apparently don't want to leave me the hell alone so I can do my normal shtick. So I'm going to come over there and address you each accordingly. Goodbye to you, mage. Don't worry, I'm coming over to deal with you too. Okay, I'm actually a little bit hurt. That's a little worrisome. Okay, I've actually got to be quite careful, because I'm actually nearly dead. And I was not expecting that. Can I... nope. Can I exit? Thank you. Can I rest? I can't sleep. Can I sleep out here? Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Now, does that reset everyone in here? That does reset everyone in here, son of a bitch. Okay. No, 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 no. Set, cut it out. Okay. Recall, anchor, just leave. Really? Okay, it's gonna be it's gonna be one of these places. That's fine. Perfectly fine. Do I have a locator device on me? I don't have a locator device on me, son of a bitch. Okay. Uh quickly uh grab a uh, do, 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 do. locator device. Thank you. See you later. Suckers. No, 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 You just do, do the world a favor and just die. Thank you. Okay, now, can I... There's enemies nearby. There's enemies nearby. Really? There's enemies nearby here. There's not. I really need some magic. Thank you. Anyway, this is going to be the last quest of today's episode, and we're going to read, and then we're going to make this a short episode, however long it is. I have no idea how long this episode's actually been, because normally I keep re separate recording sessions, typically, but, uh, uh, great, thank you, free action. But this one, I decided to just go on ahead and record in the same actual OBS session, so I don't actually know how long I've been this episode is. It could be super short for all I know, especially with the editing. Uh, nothing in here. Great. Love to see it. No, no, no. Is that a fireball? That'll I mean that's technically a fireball, but is that that's what I was... I wasn't trying to go and use uh, my cart. I was trying to loot. Okay, perfect. Okay, typically, there's a door here, and I can never pick it, of course, so I'm going to have real trouble in the next episode. If uh, we can't join the Thieves Guild, I have no idea what I'm actually going to do. Now, now, if you can just please just be deceased here in about two seconds, thank you. Take, I didn't want the toga. You know I'm not going to want a toga. Do I look like a toga man? No. And goodbye. No, no, goodbye to you, Lich. And if you don't mind, I'm going to free action. And there's enemy in your pie, which you hate to see, but there's also stairs, which you love to see. Okay, what's in here? Nothingness, but I still can't rest. Can I rest all the way? Come on, I really... Guys, I need a nap. You know, I get a little... I'm gonna let them fight it out, to be honest. Okay. Now, if you don't mind, thank you. Uh, we'll take the map, though, even though we're never going to use it. Take all this junk, even though we're never going to use it. Still can't rest. You hate to really... No. Cut it out. Take all of you, even though they're just going to be sold for gold. And can I finally rest? Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, but no, there's loot here. I'm still holding out hope. We can, I don't ever want to see the Zeppany again, even though I'm pretty sure it might show up in the other games. And if it does, by, you know, my rules, you know, all these books that we've read will be read again in Morrowind. But uh, hopefully, hopefully the Full Zeppany is not in the other games, because I'm going to be honest, or hopefully they're written more, a little bit more coherently, so I can, uh, there's not so many spaces between them, and it's a little bit more easy to read. 
but who knows. Uh, nothingness? That's a shame. Okay. So I guess we're going back. And let's actually go and drop some stuff off because I'm actually a little overcumbered. No, not that. You know, out of everything you drop me, that's the one thing you're deciding to drop. Now let's not be stupid. This is all the stuff you're wanting to drop, along with 8,300 gold. Okay, 8,300, thank you. Uh, in fact, I'm feeling a little, uh, I'm feeling like I want some revenge. So if you don't mind. Okay, well, I mean, kudos to you. But I'm gonna be over here in about two seconds, and you're gonna just gonna be in a world of trouble. Okay, bring it. Nope. I'm going to dodge. Nope. Goodbye to both of you. Caused my life living hell the last time. Pick all of you, not the shoes. And then we can rest, can rest, break, because I hate levitating if I don't have to. Make sure there's no doors. There's probably going to be doors, but we can always check. And go down. Goodbye to you. Excuse me? That was weird. I didn't want to just randomly go back up. That's odd. Hmm. Well, there's a door. There's another door. There's a freaking lich. Well, there's a dead lich. Let's be you know, correct with our terminology. Make sure there's a, there's a door here. Now, rules dictate that there's typically somebody in that room, but apparently rules don't apply in this scenario. Uh, okay, excuse me, good sir, you are going to be dead here in about two seconds, and I didn't want that, I wanted a fireball. Take that. And we can rest. Great. And I don't know why I'm going down here, because there's nothing in there ever, so I don't know why I did it. But... Oh! Uh... Hold on. There's a teleport? That's what happened. Okay. Much, much... Makes much more sense. Okay. I feel... Vindicated. I feel... Just all sorts of happiness that I now know what is going on and it feels like I'm not going crazy. Completely understandable. Okay. Excuse me. I would like to free action. Thank you. And no. Listen, mage, you sit down and shut up. Okay. Dead end? Seriously, completely dead end. Everything over here is dead end. Really? Interesting. I find that extremely hard to believe. But apparently it's true. Okay, dead end. And then I guess we're going over here, and that's the last area this way. Hmm. I don't know why I find it so hard to believe that that was just a... Oh, boy. Okay, well, before we go that way, let's go and look over... Okay, up... This should lead us around to the back. No, listen. You know if you see a lich, you want a fireball. I don't know why. I don't know what spell you're using. All of us. Oh, I know what spell you're using. You're using reaction. But listen, okay? That's obviously not what I'm wanting. If I see a f lich, I'm going to want fireball. And I would really like for you to you know, actually hit the, you know, the person you're swinging at instead of missing 46 times. I'm going to be just straight up honest with you. Okay. Now, before we make progress this way... My uh, keen knowledge of uh, layouts, not this way. My keen knowledge of layouts knows that based on the rules of how dungeons are laid out, that typically... Okay, well, I mean, if you don't want to die, that's unfortunate for me. Because now it means I have to kill you the old... 
Oh boy, I really don't like that that opened up in my face. What is it? Okay, well, I don't mind now. As long as it's not a lich, I don't mind too much. Okay. Okay. I, I mind a little bit if you're gonna just freeze me out like I'm, um, you know. Thank you. And thank you. And take all of you. I actually wanted that. Now, typically, that's okay. So it's not there. So it could theoretically be over here and right here. And it's not. So that's... I have to be careful. I'm going to die. Okay. Oh, my God. I got so, so, so lucky. Let me close this door immediately. I hear things, and it scares me. I'm running for my life. If you don't mind. I'm running this way, this way, this way, and I'm running all the way over here if you don't mind. And this room, and I'm gonna sit. Because I need to heal. And I actually need to save, because... Okay, you I don't mind so much. Okay, well I mind if you, you know, freeze me out, but... Take all of that. But I do need to finish healing and taking a nap, so if you don't mind, I'm gonna take a tiny bit of a nap, and I'm going to save hear it I have no idea if this is from the last game or not is this from the last I have no idea so we're gonna we're gonna rename this uh, uh, temple final exploring because I have no idea if that cavern is this cavern or if we're in a completely different area and I just did not I don't think I saved when I started but the locator device hums which is always nice which tells me it's in that direction interesting in that direction and that is indicative of this way this way okay no 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 sits no listen you stop freezing me and you too and we'll take everything you got and it's gonna be this way, this direction, this direction, this direction, not this direction, definitely not this direction, and absolutely not this direction. Okay, listen, be gone, thank you. And I'm gonna take a tiny bit of a nap because I'm hurt. Okay. I don't like the fact that we were near it and then we weren't. So it's possibly this way. Yes, it's this way and this way. Um, excuse me. Fireball, fireball. Oh, okay, or we can fireball each other. I'm fine with that as long as you're dead too and as long as I don't die in step process, you can hit me with these fireballs. Perfect door, love to see it. Goodbye to you, you killer of dragons. This is from the Akatosh Chantry. Uh, uh, wins. All I ever wanted was to be free of the dragons. The dragon slayer is dead. Thank you. Goodbye. Don't even need it. So I'm going to drop it. Uh, recall. Teleport. Get out of here. Well, actually, not get out of here quite yet. I uh, drop off all of this stuff because I'm a little over encumbered. In between episodes, I need to go and sell all this stuff because my cart's getting a tiny, tiny bit full. And drop off 11,702 gold because why not? And go back to Pinbury Hamlet. And we'll see what rank we... Actually, I can check kind of to a degree right now what rank we're going to get. We're going to get 85, which means I'm going to have to do some a little bit of grind. I think of like two or three quests off uh, screen. So, And then I'll probably include it right... I'll probably include it right at the... As soon as I'm done turning in this quest. And I'll include it before we do the outro and the book. So... Uh, but no, this was, this was the, the temple quest. Honestly, enjoyed it. The heretic was, I think, the most interesting quest because it, I got stuck on it for a while because I didn't know you needed to wait 21 days. Uh, hey dude, I'm glad to see you back, Massive, and your mission was a success. As I promised, here's your 619 goal. Thank you for your service. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And let me check. So 84, so I need roughly 15, so I need to do about three quests. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a break. 
and I will be back once we have reached the max in the temple. All right, fast by your virtue of by your virtue of unparalleled devotion and legendary personal prowess, we have Akatosh are honored to offer you the title of Patriarch of the Akatosh. The title of Patriarch is the highest honor Akatosh recognizes, but our pride in you knows no bounds. For many of us, you are the ideal to which we aspire, Patriarch Vassa, and that is the max rank in the Temple Guild. So, in the next episode, we are... Well, first off, did I mark the last quest? I did not mark the last quest of Temple Guild. complete, so let me do that first. So, we have, as far as quests left, we technically have fighter quests left, but one of them angers I forget what I'm gonna have to go back and check one of them angers a main main story NPC so we need to probably wait and do that until we're at least a decent way into the main story and one of them angers something else I forget it. it's one of the factions I'm, at this point I might have enough status status with one of the factions where I can do that quest but other than that we only have main quests left and thieves guild which is the next what we're gonna be doing next we technically have merchants and innkeeper quests, but we're going to not do those. Noble quests, we're not going to do those. Uh, and then really the only other quest we're going to be doing, besides the Thieves Guild main quest, is the Daedric quests. But that, I've already decided, uh, we're going to be doing because I've learned a lot of gold. But we're going to do them anyway. Yes, yeah, so I'm just going to uh, console command in the gold so we can at least do the quests. Because I, I do want to see the quests and kind of experience them. I want you guys to experience them as well. So I feel comfortable doing that, fine doing that at level 25. We're not really going into any major problems that any deaths I'm getting are, you know, from Daedra lords that are kill me, or vampires that kill me just because they want to drain my stamina completely. Um, but yeah, so uh, these guilds next. Hopefully, if we can uh, lock pick successfully a store during night without an open spell, is how we're going to get it. Because otherwise, I think you have to pickpocket 15 people, which is not going to be easy. Um, so let me put my sword away. And I'm going to end the episode. For those that want to stick around, we're going back to one book an episode. Uh, and today's book is Fragment on Arteum. That's what we're reading. So for those that want to stick around and listen, you can as we go on ahead and head our back our way to Gothway Garden, our little home away from home, which we're eventually going to buy a home in. I imagine. I think we probably can buy a home in Gothway Garden. Uh, so for those that want to stick around and listen to that, they can. But for those that don't, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of The Elder Scrolls II Daggerfall. If you haven't already, go down and hit the subscribe button and the bell notification to stay up to date on when new videos come to the channel. Uh, stay up to date via the community tab. After Daggerfall is done, we're going to be doing uh, Starfields, honestly, the next thing that's come up. But after Starfields done, we're going to be moving on to Morrowind, we're gonna be, which is 100% blind. We're going to be doing Oblivion, which is 100% blind. Skyrim, which is not 100% blind in any stretch of the imagination. It's the first game I ever played. Made me fall in love with the Elder Scrolls series. But uh, yeah, so we got a lot of Elder Scrolls and a lot of Bethesda really in our future. Uh, so yeah, so if you guys could take a minute, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. I appreciate it so, so much. You guys have no idea how much hitting the thumbs up button helps the channel grow, get recognition with the algorithm and everything. I would appreciate it. Uh, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye. And for those that do want to stick around and listen, I will be back when you find From the Memory, or not, oh, no, Fragment on Artea. Found it. Fragment on Artea. It's not that long. You'd love to see it. Let me mark it as red. Don't have to read a 56 page novel of Fool's Ebony this episode. So that's always nice. <clears throat> Fragment on Artea by Tariq Il Anselma, Third Era 400. The Isle of Artea. Arteum is the third largest island in the Somerset Archipelago, located south of the Moridan village of Panansa and west of the mainland village of Runki Bay. It's best known for being the home of the Sijigord, perhaps the oldest monastic group in Tamriel. The earliest written record of the Sijiks is from the 12th, no, it's from the 20th year of the First Era and tells the tale of the author, the renowned Breton sage, Vornet. Traveling to the Isle of Artame to meet with the right master of the Sijiks, Lachesis, even then the Sijiks were the counselors of kings and proponents of the Elder Way, taught to them by the original people of Tamriel. The Elder Way is a philosophy of meditation and study said to bind the forces of nature to the individual will. It differs from Magicka in origin, but the effects are much the same. That being said, it is perhaps more than coincidence that the Isle of Artaeum literally vanished from the shores of Somerset at the beginning of the Second Era, at about the time of the founding of the Mage's Guild of Tamriel. Various historians and scholars have published theories about this, but perhaps none but 
Lacaeus and his own shed light on this. 500 years have passed, Arpaeum returned. The Citrix on the Isle consisted of persons, mostly elves, who had disappeared and were presumed dead over the second century. Sorry, second era. They could not or would not offer an explanation of Arteum's whereabouts during the time or the fate of Lacaeus and the original Council of Arteum. Currently, the Sijiks are led by the Lore Master Stellaris, who has presided over the Council of Arteum for the last 250 years. The Council's influence in world politics is titled. The kings of Somerset, particularly those in Mordoran, have often sought the Sijiks' opinion. The Earl V was much influenced by the Council and the early most glorious part of his reign before his disastrous attack on Akavir. It has even been suggested that the fleet of King Ogum of Pyandonea Pian was destroyed by the joint effort of the Emperor Antiochus and the Sijic Order. The last four emperors, Ural VI, Morihatha, Pelagius IV, and Uriel VII, have been suspicious of the Sijics, even enough to refuse ambassadors for the Isle of Artaeum in the Imperial City. The Isle of Artame is difficult to chart geographically. It is said that parts of it exist simultaneously in multiple dimensions and continuously shift, either at random or by decree of council. Visitors to the island are so rare to be almost unheard of. Anyone de des uh, desirous of a meeting with the Sijix may find contacts in Panassa, Runkabay, as well as many of the kingdoms of Somerset. Were it more accessible, Artame would be a favorite destination for travelers. I've been to the island Isle once, and still dream of the idyllic sh or uh, orchards and pastures, the still and silent lagoons, the misty woodlands, and the unique Sijic architecture that seems to be a natural but wondrous at, as the surroundings. The Sephora Tower, in particular, I would study, for it is a ruin from a civilization that predates the High Elves by several hundred years, and is still used in certain rites by the Sijics. Perhaps one day I might return. Note. The author is currently on the Isle of Arteum by gracious consent of Master Sarginius, the Council of Arteum. And that was a fragment on Arteum. So for those that stuck around and listened, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.